The rebuilding of provincial headquarters Kapalaus has received the highest allocation of 50 million kina, and that has been the commitment from the national government. And another 10 million kina for city roads. This brings to total 60 million kina for the redevelopment of Mount Agen City. The highlight of the expenditure budget after state development priorities, it is estimated that almost 60% is allocated for developments such as transport infrastructure, that is roads and bridges, education, agriculture, rural health services, and law and order. 15 million kina will go towards the upgrading and sealing of major roads for economic development. And with coffee as the major revenue earner, 8.5 million kina was allocated for coffee rehabilitation and development. The education sector has received 9 million kina to undertake infrastructure for new and existing schools. Governor Pais Winti in its budget brief called on all public servants in the four electorates to drive the development agendas. I'm now focusing by Stop Long. Stop Long or this last something. That's all. This is two inner nap me play in Napla Chivi. Unless all members play me play come and say long partnership. So in and up, in and up. So me play me play putting this money in or minus me play driving province. Governor Winty said his government is ready to address law and order problems in the city and is investing 3.3 million kina. He described the budget of 23.8 million kina as a record no other provincial governments in the past has ever undertaken. Michelle Amba, National MTV News.